Sweet. Um, all right, cool. So. Wow, this feels quieter than, um, than Crash Team Racing. Or maybe not. Uh, so, last time I was on here, we basically, um, found Artorius. Um, I've never played the DLC of this before, so... Um... I ended up dying a fair few times, well, a couple of times, and then I thought, right, I'm just gonna leave it, and come back, try again. So, yeah, we'll see what we can do. Hopefully... Hopefully we'll be alright. But we might die a few times, so bear with me. This is Dark Souls after all. I remember. The Royal Wood. No, no. He's, he's shaking his head. It's like, no, no, no. Okay. So we did get this shortcut up here. this way and basically we get here now oh thank you so much for the best thank you it's a very sweet coffee lady So, where were we? Yeah, so we'd been all, all the way up around that area and seen the abyss had... That's it. Like, the abyss basically opened up and it was, like, spewing out all this, like, purple shit. It looked pretty nasty. I remember. Oh god damn it. I don't want to do this. Ah. Oh, no need. Dude. Oh, far out, okay. He throws some, like... Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. What a move. What a move. Well, the fight begins. Oh, no. Death, the death. Oh, goodness. <sighs> Who needs Artorias when you've got a cliff?
<laughs> Sweet. They're nice and easy to deal with. Yeah, so soon we'll actually have, um, we'll be able to, well, at some point in the near future, we'll hopefully be able to move on to Dark Souls 2. Oh, for Juniper's sake, put some spring into your step. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. So He's me. Glad for this coffee. Shit. Oh, well, here we go. Sixty six damage. Oh, God, that's nasty. Oh. Oh, I'm getting screwed here. Oh, I'm getting absolutely nailed. I mean, I guess he is like, you know, the ancient knight. Won't be a hard and easy boss. <sighs> yeah, it's cool how the, the, the walls are still there at the top. Kind of makes it you know, you you kind of realise just how far back some of this shit goes, you know. The Royal Wood. It's got infected. Yeah. It's pretty great. I'm determined to get him though. I think I think like starting this grind is good. I guess what I want to know is that bridge goes Come on here. Oh no. Leave me alone. Please. He's like bleeding. Yeah, fuck. This is really tough. It's 
Some would say too tough. But not I. Well, how does this look actually? Did that there? It's kind of a bit of a pain, isn't it? Put you back there. Okay, so I've learned from watching streams that you should always put the lift back up. <sighs> honestly, I, d I don't know. I might need to come back here, honestly, after I've done some other stuff, because there's tough there's all of the like there's all of the painted world there's like oh my god that move drink glug 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 Wow. Hmm. Oh, he tracks with that. Oh, no. Plug, plug. The kind of interesting thing with him is that you can't... Mm.
It's tough to actually get decent damage on him. <clears throat> um. It is. This is tough. I don't know his move set though either. I know that he's got a few things like the stab. <sighs> oh my goodness. Just nasty. Oh, come on. Glug, glug, fucking glug. Shit in my face. No, you. All right. Sick. Yeah, fully, man. That's really good. How have you found it? Like, you managed to keep sane. It's just crazy, isn't it? Like, how. Drink. Oh, get stabbed. Yeah, they've started to kind of open stuff up, but like it's it's still pretty it's still pretty crazy. Oh god, I'm just getting wrecked. is a perfect summary. Ah, <laughs> oh, whoever that dude is probably is like, uh, sorry guys. <laughs> oh shit, that is amazing. One dude eats a bat. <clears throat> that is the funniest. Yeah, it's it's kind of weird. It's like they're opening everything up a little bit now in England. But like, um, yeah, like they're saying you have to wear masks and, and all that sort of stuff, which is fine now. Oh, just get wrecked if you get cocky on this game. Blah, 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 blah. Um, yeah, to be fair, like I've, I've not uh, kept up to date too much on it. Just that I know they're starting to open up like shops and stuff now. Um, 
Yeah. And hopefully... So I'm in the UK here, if you didn't know. Probably no surprise, right? After I'm like, where's the tea? Um, but... Oh, fuck you guys. No. Oh, I'm gonna do that again. Yeah. <laughs> um. <laughs> he just followed me in. Um. Yeah, but they they basically uh, I think like from the fifteenth of June, like certain shops were open. And then now they're starting to let people go to each other's houses, but only one other house, you know? So you can choose, I guess it's for like grandparents to see their grandkids maybe or stuff like that, but. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, it's surprising, man. The UK got, got hit pretty hard. And I don't know exactly why. I think, I think people here were just kind of like, ah, it's nothing. And then suddenly it was like, oh, it's kind of serious. Your stores were always open, but everything else was shut down. Yeah. Yeah, we had like, I guess like the main, the emergency store. So like, like food, like that, stuff like that. Like, um, you know, like supermarkets and stuff, they stayed open. But anything that wasn't like, like, uh, classed as like a essential shop was like closed. Holy fuck, seriously. Man, it's crazy. There's, um, there's a really good. Have you heard of uh, what is it? World Ometer. World Ometers. Right, hold on. You might have heard of it. I don't know. But I'll just post that in there. Right. Take a look at that link. It's like a, a website where, um, basically it shows like all of like the updates i mean it, it's originally a website that shows how many people are in the world how many people are dying every second or how many people are born every second it's got some cool stats and it updates all the time um but it's got like a coronavirus update thing on there as well and it shows like a chart of all the world's countries and like um how many people have been infected how many have died on on a day-to-day -day basis it, it's really informative um but it's also quite fascinating as well because you see that these massive numbers and you're just like far out this world is is big <clears throat> but you can see on there it's like i remember when when they were starting all of the stuff with like lockdowns and all that sort of stuff it's like i was watching um every day you could see like certain countries, like Sweden, who weren't, um, they were kind of like, ah, you know, it's, it's people's responsibility. Um, and you could see the kind of, you know, it's quite sad, but you could see the, the kind of the infection and death rate kind of increasing. Um, my, my girlfriend, she's from Australia. Um, so I was kind of comparing the two because at one point they were on a similar sort of um, level of infection and stuff, but Australia stayed, they closed everything down and they've stayed really quite low, whereas it, like, you could see other countries just go, like, up and up, so. Anyway, yeah. That's amazing about Norway. Like, it just goes to show.
Yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? <laughs> Shit. Yeah, it is. I'm going to go back to that website now. One sec. Yeah, it's absolutely wild. Births this year. And we're halfway through the year and there's been 63 million births. <laughs> 63 million babies just spurted out this year. I love stuff like this. It's fascinating. <laughs> ah, man. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's up at the top there. <laughs> oh, it's brilliant. It's like as well when you just see the numbers just going up so fast, you're like... Boof. Yeah, it's a pretty cool website though, hey. Like... One of my faves. Oh, just go. Leave me alone. No, oh, I should change my... Well, oh, it's a bit late now. Have you seen flight radar? You know what? Um... Yes. I... Actually use it. Um, so like I said, my girlfriend's from Australia, so when she, you know, in the past she's kind of like flown home or flown back. So dense with planes, you don't see the planet. <laughs> yeah, it, it's just wild, isn't it? I wonder how it's looked actually, like in the last few months. Like I wonder if it's like looked a little bit... Uh, different. Like, probably less, like, quite a lot less planes, I reckon. Come on, Artorius. Fuck, that is a bad move. And that is. In fact, all his moves are bad. It looked just as dense? Seriously. God damn, that's crazy. Ugh. Maybe it missed one or two layers of planes covering the map. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, shit. No, it is, it is wild. Yeah, there's a, um, uh, what's it called? Is it called City in the S- Now, I know there's a song called City in the Sky, which is a horrible, horrible song. <laughs> but I think there's actually a documentary called Cities in the Sky or something like that. And I think that the point of it is it's all about air, like airplane travel and how um, 
there's like heaps of people in the air at any one time. Bioshock 3? Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> I was just struggling to what, know what you meant there, but yeah. Yeah, no, not Bioshock 3. <laughs> um, but that is an actual city in the sky. But yeah, it's, it's basically just on about because there's like however many hundred thousand people or even maybe into the millions that are in the sky at any one time because of how many planes there are. And it's just so weird when you think of it. Man, same here. Holy shit. I, I reckon, I hope it will. I hope it will happen. I reckon it will. I do think so. Elon Musk, like, is just crazy, you know? And, like, well, he's not crazy, as in he, he's, like, he's doing the right thing. And, like, really pushing for um, spaceflight to be so cheap, I think it really will help go a long, long way. I don't know, man. Like, it's exciting. Okay. Oh, that's a nasty one. Watched some YouTube videos earlier. Never realized you could actually land a rocket like it was pre-launch. Yeah, it was only him that... Shit. Yeah, but Musk did it. I know. Yeah, have you seen the video where, like, the two rockets just come down side by side? It's... It gives me goosebumps every time. It's uh, incredible. Oh, you've not seen it? Uh, my computer might not handle... Um... Me... Shit, like, watching another video while I'm streaming. Let me try and get the link for you. Um, two rocket. Or if you just Google, if you just YouTube search, like, like, SpaceX, two rockets landing, you'll see it straight away. Um, it was like... It was the it was the launch of their like biggest rocket that they've made, and it had two of those boosters, um, and it was like the whole thing was like, um, you know, can we land these back? You know, it's just incredible. First time, oh, it's just wild, man. History is being made. It's so exciting. Let me know if you, once you've seen it, if you do find it. I'll be here just getting my ass handed to me by this fucking boss. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, like, and the way they do it, there's, like, no parachutes. It's, like, all, like, rockets, just, like, and little kind of, you know, guidance things just landing it back. It's, oh. How they did it. It's awesome. Long time for coffee. I wonder what my shield does actually. Does it help? 
It does, actually. So maybe I'll try. Oh, that doesn't make a difference, does it? Okay. move. Yeah. He is tough, this guy, for sure. Hey, bro. Get out of there. Get out. Yeah, this game... Um, are their moves predictable or mostly random? If they are predictable... Okay, well, they do have, like, a specific move set, you know? But, like, what they use out of that is kind of tough to predict. Does that make sense? At least, especially for me. Um, there are some people that play this game who are just unbelievably skilled. Yeah, you really do. It's it's so good though. I I gotta say the combat on this game is like it really is so good. It makes you just feel especially after you if you beat the boss, you know, it makes you feel really good. Like Oh dear. Alright. But it's almost like you kind of have to expect that you're going to die, you know? And then just kind of like, uh-oh, what's he doing? Uh... Okay, so these are new moves. <laughs> this is not fair. Um, but it's a really great kind of way of, of progressing, you know? Kind of like teaches you... Essentially, you just get better by doing it. But there's just some stuff that is ridiculous. Yeah, no, nothing like that. <laughs> Unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it can try. I, 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 uh, it's not successful yet. <laughs> no, nah, it's, it's, um, Yeah, I could go on for a while, but I, but I think this game is one of my favorites of all time. It's like, especially... I think, I think just the way it kind of is like made, that it, it doesn't treat, it doesn't have different levels of kind of, you know, uh, difficulty. It's like... 
It's like if you're playing the game, it's like you get punished. Just the same as anybody else, you know. Um, but it's like gradually you kind of begin to get better and better and learn and... Like you say, some of the some of the bosses are scary. Some of the moments are pretty scary. Um, but you slowly learn and it becomes a little less kind of scary over time, you know? Um, but yeah, it's, it's so good. But I don't know, this boss is like really tough. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to actually get this done. I hope so. Oh shit. in Red Dead 2 is hard enough for me. <laughs> Man. Oh, it's so good that you're like starting out. I'm so... I'm really excited for you. Like, I kind of wish now that I'm at the end of it that I could like wipe my memory and play it all again. Um, that's so good. Yeah, Red Dead 3. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if they will. I'm not sure. I feel like... I feel like... Rockstar, since Red Dead 2, they've gone quiet again. And I know with the PS5 announcement, they were like... They made an announcement on that... Um, stream. That like... Oh, GTA 5 is coming to PlayStation 5. And it's like, well, okay. But it's, it started on PlayStation 3, right? So, props GTA 6? Yeah, maybe. I mean, I wonder, like, if they will... It's definitely due for an update. But if the online stuff for GTA... The online stuff for GTA 5, like, has really... <clears throat> like, it really expanded that game, you know? Like, and brought, like, a heap more than just, like, the original story. So I wonder if... I, I don't know. I just, I wonder if they will try, like, something new, like they did with Red Dead 1. Or if they will just kind of carry on with the GTA 6. I don't know, it's always fun to kind of guess. Yeah, fair enough. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Oh man, he just attacks non-stop. Okay. Alright.
I think it's kind of cool to see how far they've come though. Like, Rockstar. Like from Grand Theft Auto 1, like that sort of bird's eye view overhead. Come on. Right, I'm going to have a couple more goes and then see if we can do it. Oh shit! Oh no! Get out of there! Oh god damn it, dogs. I kind of hope they will remake San Andreas. Man, that would actually be awesome. Like make the map like and the cities and stuff much more expansive. That would be pretty sweet. Yeah, I remember when that came out. Just being like... We'll have all cities in one game. Yeah. I mean, like, for it, for when it came out, for the time, it was huge, you know? You know, they never remade Vice City either. Yeah, true. <sighs> yeah, it's a tough one. That could be really fun. Especially with all of the sort of, like, you know, 90s... Sorry, 80s music and... Damn, that game was something else, wasn't it? It was brilliant. Alright. I reckon though... I reckon they're gonna, like... Okay, no shield. We're going to just dodge him. Come on. Hit me. Alright, you did. You win. You win. You win. Shit, what a move. All right. Just gets rid of all of your stamina. Okay. Damn it. Oh no. Don't even get time to heal. It's crazy. Oh, 
No. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Oh no. Heal. Oh, fuck. This guy is by far hardest boss I have found on this game. Damn, 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 damn. Oh, shit. All right, I'm going to try. <laughs> I can have one more good go and then that'll be it. I'll have to, uh, I'll have to finish up. Got some food to make. <laughs> Man, thanks so much for joining. Honestly, like, it's, that's, it's been a real pleasure. Are you going to do some Red Dead tonight? Oh, yeah, of course, man. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, I've had a... Um, it's strange. I've had a couple of people, like, you know... I'm going to continue after eating. Yeah, awesome. Oh, man, enjoy it. Yeah, if you uh, if you want, like I'm like I'm I'm here like um, every day apart from Thursday and Sunday, right? So yeah, let me know like if you're making progress, like let me know where you're at. I'd love to hear more because it's just such a joy, like just remembering all the parts of the game that you've played through. Um, yeah, definitely let me know. It'd be a real real joy. <laughs> Oh, Come on. That move's tough to dodge. No. All right, we're getting there. I feel like 
he's definitely... Okay. He can't get cocky on these games, but I feel like he's beginning to... I'm beginning to get used to him a little bit. We'll get him eventually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he is getting too cocky. All right. Cool. Phase two. Fight. Then he does that, and that, and... The hardest thing with this is that his attacks are so fast, you know? That's a nasty one. All right, all right, all right, you win. Oh, God, damn you. Uh oh. That was good. Come on. Yes. see what I mean about you can kind of you get a bit used to you do get used to like their move sets you know but oh shit uh oh does not give you a chance. All right. Come closer. But this guy is so fast and his sword is twice as big as... <sighs> fully. Did you ever play, um... Kingdom Hearts? Oh, shizer. Sh Probably compensate. <laughs> Probably. I said, definitely. I never played, but watched a lot of streams. Yeah. Yeah, it's a cool game, but um, one of the battles in that, one of the secret sort of bosses in the first game was Sephiroth from Final Fantasy VII. No. Shit. Can't recover from that one. Alright. God, that was not bad. We got, like, over half of his health was done there, so that's not too bad. Yeah, so, so the, anyway, 
that boss on that game, I remember just being like, heaps hard. Sword sad. <laughs> Sword of seals, that's wicked. How do I... Can I tap that? Will that... Oh, cool. I like it. I'll give them a follow. There you go. Sweet. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's just a notoriously hard final boss battle. Um... The tapping even works on phone now. Uh, what do you mean? Hmm. Like tapping on the emote? You mean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right. That wasn't, um... I mean, I feel like... I wasn't able to do that even probably a couple of days ago. So that's really cool. Oh yeah, sweet. Oh no, that one doesn't work. Oh no, that's a global. That's a global one. That's why. Noob! That's me. <laughs> um. Yeah, oh my... Goodness, dude, thanks so much for coming and hanging out today. Like, really appreciate that. They have to know as well, like, um, uh, you saying about when you first joined and that guy was like, you know, spamming and I ended up banning that guy. It's so funny, but like, just, yeah, thanks so much for kind of for, for being around because that made me feel a lot better. Like, actually having someone on stream that wasn't just being a dick, you know. Uh, so yeah, thanks so much, man. Really appreciate it. Um, you've been on here since 2014. Holy shit. Wow. Yeah, so I bet you... I bet you've seen a fair amount. There's trolls everywhere. Yeah. It's unreal. Earlier on, I had a person... Oh, fuck, man. It was so weird. Okay, so my my username is Slide on Branches, right? And then they're streaming. Um, they were funnier back in those days. Um, and anyway, next thing, I get this follow um, alert. I'm like, okay, uh, who's that? Slide on Branches 2 is now following you. I'm like, oh, shit, okay. He comes in the chat, and he's just like, lol, 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 lol. I, uh, I set up accounts copying streamers' usernames or something like that. It's just like, oh, fuck, man. So, gave him a healthy ban. But anyway, it was just so weird. It's like, what the hell? Contact Twitch time and get his IP banned if he keeps going. Ah, oh, seriously. Dude, that's amazing to know. I had like... Within... 20 minutes... I had about... Four... New... Follows. One from... This slide on branches too. I'm like, okay. Like... Ah! Okay. That's good to know. Yeah, it was definitely a little bit suspect. Um, and that's really good to know that there's that. Because I was wondering, I was like, how do they actually know? It's like if someone sets up a username and that gets banned, how does Twitch know, you know, uh, that they that, that you can't just then create another username and do the exact same thing? So, we, you know, so essentially it could just be like, slide on branches three, slide on branches four. Um, but, yeah, if you can kind of work it on IP, then that is really good. Yeah. It's so funny, isn't it? 
Auto ban them from your channel. Auto ban them from your channel? Really? Yeah, this, like, so I've been going only, I've only been streaming, to be fair, a few weeks, so it's, it's pretty, pretty young on Twitch. Um, so there's, like, heaps that I've yet to learn. Um, man, honestly, like, thanks so much for your help, like, seriously, I really appreciate it. Uh, you have no idea how much better it's made me feel today. Seriously. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Been really cool. So, uh. I'll take a look at that. And yeah, that's a cool one. Yeah, that's wicked. Yeah, I've, I've made a note of it as well. Like. Yeah, I do not get it, man. I either. But plenty of people know. Yeah. Unfortunately. Ah, it keeps it interesting, right? Keeps it interesting. Oh, man. Well, yeah. Really, thanks again. And, um... Yeah, like, have a have a good weekend. Have a good, like, day tomorrow as well. I hope Red Dead goes well. Um, I think I will be back Monday, and I reckon Monday will be... Uh, how can I see my schedule from here? I can't. I think. Oh, no, absolutely. Yeah, that's my pleasure. I think it's really cool. That's one amazing thing about Twitch, I think, is just like, like how you can kind of, uh, yeah, it's just really cool, like how you can kind of meet people from wherever and just like kind of hang out. It's really, it's such a good uh, platform, I think. You're always, usually always on an evening after work. Sweet. All right, cool. Well, I, um... I'm thinking of moving my stream hours a little bit later, but I'm currently on like two till seven ish, like UK time, so you know, but I'll see. Twitch and Discord pretty intertwined. Yeah, I'm actually um, looking into Discord as well. I do have a Discord, um, but I've not yet put it up on my uh, Twitch panels or anything because I, I just. If I'm honest, that like it's another platform that I'm not sure how to use entirely yet, so I've just got to like get used to it, figure it out. Um, but I think it would be really cool as well. Good to have like the both of them, you know. Um, yeah. All right, dude. Well, um. Yeah, have a good evening, and uh, I'll I'll be back again Monday with I think it is Crash Team Racing. Oh no, no, it's not. It's Hollow Knight. It's Hollow Knight. That's it. If it changes, it might. Oh, I'll obviously update it all, but otherwise, yeah. Cool, man. Well. Um not got any music working this time so it's just gonna be silent end <laughs> uh yeah see you around man thanks so much for watching and chatting and stuff and uh yeah catch you around soon all right cheers bye for now <laughs>